Hey, welcome back to another video here on the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you a video on how to install mods on Steam, PC, Arc Survival Evolved. I've had a few questions about this in the comment section, so I'll quickly go over how to install mods for Arc Survival Evolved. If you do enjoy this video, make sure like button and subscribe to become a human being. We're currently doing a modded series, which everyone is, seems to be enjoying, so make sure to check out that series. Link will be above and below. Let's get into this. So first of all, before you want anything, this will only work for Steam. If you're on Epic Games or Windows 10, you cannot install mods. You have to have Ark Survival Evolved on Steam, which we've got in front of us right now, and that is how you can install mods. So the best way to do this is to go to Library, click on Ark, and then uh, look at how much time you spent on this game and cry a little bit. Go to Workshop, and the Workshop is basically where you're going to find all your mods. Uh, straight off the bat, super easy. So here we've got a few lists. You've got the most popular, most subscribed, and most recent. Avoid the most recent. <laughs> you even want to look at the most popular, the most subscribed. Obviously, S Plus, the original Structures Plus, is one of the top ones, followed by Classic Flyers, Ultra Stacks, and Awesome Spyglass, Awesome Teleporters. All these are amazing mods. Now, the mod that I actually want to look at and download is Titan Map, but we will uh, show you a different way because it is right there. So basically, if you want to search for your mod, you can just type it here, for example. Let's go for something that we haven't got. Super Spyglass. I don't think we've got this. We do got this. Okay. Actually, let's search Pokemon. Okay, so there's a couple of Pokemon mods here. I do actually want to make a video of exploring one of these. So, uh, Pokemon Evolved 1.78. Now, this brings Pokemon into Arc. Look at this. It is insane. We are definitely going to subscribe to this so basically to install the mod all you gotta do is hit subscribe and as you can see down here in the download section you got zero of one so if something is downloading right now that is the mod that we just clicked now this works exactly the same for maps so i want to install the new titan map so here we go we found the titan map this is a brand new map that's coming very shortly we're going to subscribe to that exactly the same thing as you see it says subscribed if you go down to downloads now you can see that we have a arc file downloading uh, it's only 300 meg i'm pretty sure that's the first one and then the second one will download which is the map which will be a couple of gig basically you're just going to wait for this to download okay so once the mods have finished downloading what you're going to do is you're just going to go back to your library load up arc just play it as normal. Once you're in Arc, if you're playing on single player, what you could do is go over to whatever map. And as you can see, you have active mods on the right hand side and also available mods. What you're going to do is this will normally be empty. You're going to scroll down, or you probably won't if you only installed one mod. But you're basically going to find the mod that you've just downloaded. For example, if you wanted the wardrobe skin, you're going to press this button and it's going to put it up into active mods. Now, when you load whichever map that you play, once you load that, these mods that are active will be loaded into that save just to be warned say that we played on the island with all these mods but you wanted to play genesis part 2 with different mods so you take all these off and you put new mods on if you go back to the island and kick play without changing the mods back all the mod stuff will be deleted so that's something to be really careful about make sure you remember what mods you've got on what playthroughs uh, of which maps you're doing because if you do log into a map that you've removed a mod it will delete everything to do with that mod off that map and then when you reinstall it, it won't all come back. You'll just be like a fresh start. So just keep that in mind. If you don't want a mod anymore, you just click the button here. Get rid of the mod. That's pretty much it. That's very easy to do. Now, if it's server side, it's pretty much exactly the same. You'll load up the mods on the server side. And then you'll just go to join. And for example, as you can see, we've got our modded series right here. And it's got, uh, I think, 23 mods. And you're just going to click join as normal once you've installed. Because you can see right down in the bottom corner here, it's installing the mods that I updated prior to this. And the two mods that we've just installed. And that is pretty much it. Anyways, thank you all for watching. That is how you install mods on Steam PC for Arc Survival Evolved. If you enjoyed, make sure to like button, subscribe to the community, and I'll catch you in the next video.